Hey everybody, this is Fragrant Ray back once again with a look back at, but at this time, The Incredible Hulk. Hey ho! I've never played this game, so this is all you. I'm just here for the ride. Well, this is, you know, with your city. Yeah, I've, New York. I've not seen the Hulk roaming around, but that is my city. It's mine, no one else's. I actually own the whole city. Oh just yeah, me. I see. I thought it actually was your city. I thought you owned it. Yeah, yeah, it's mine. No one else's, just mine. <laughs> now, this is actually a movie game. It, it is. And it's it actually, is. from what I hear, a pretty good one. It's a very good movie game because uh, unlike most of the other Marvel movie-based games like Iron Man and etc. <laughs> and Iron Man 2. <laughs> and, and, and Thor. Oh, God. At least Captain America wasn't bad. Uh, yeah, it wasn't too bad. But uh, this is probably the best because it is pretty much just the Hulk in New York City. Have fun. The game, yeah. It's yeah. open world, correct? It's a full open world of New York City. Okay. And uh, you can actually do quite a bit in this game. There's actually a lot of collectibles, but a lot of them are kind of fun, though. All right. Do they do anything for you? Or are they like... Uh... Um, yes. Okay. The, the main two do, which uh, for the first two achievements is PPO'd and Angered Management, which is to get the green and the rage canisters, and those increase your health and your rage meters. All right. So get those, because they're helpful. Mm -hmm. And there's probably like 300 there total between the two of them. Oh, that's kind of annoying. It's a lot, but, you know, it's an open-world game. What do you expect? Ah, uh, it's like 10 of each? Like, why yeah. is it got to be 300? Bullshit. At well, least well, they're better that. than the ones in, um, like, Prototype. Oh, God. Yeah. They were everywhere. Yeah. And there was, like, 18 different kinds. Mm hmm But uh, before we go even deeper into the collectibles, we should actually say that uh, it's got a few things that make it a really good open-world game, though. Oh. One, it has a mission select. Oh, that's good. It's awesome. Like, just the fact you can go to your menu and go, oh, I want to do this mission. And it will actually, like, reset the world to that mission. Oh, okay. That's actually pretty cool. I didn't know that. Yeah, so you can actually, like, kind of reset some things and mm -hmm. just fix things, too. But um, there's one thing that's really important that I recommend, which is you're going to start off in, like, South America, like in the movie. That's not New York at all. Okay. That's not New York at all. And then you travel to New York City. Okay. When you first get to New York City, you don't have your whole wanted meter and stuff. So right then and there, do all your collecting. Because you're not going to have all the guys coming after you. Do they just, like, get on you just for collecting the collectibles? Well, like, what happened is, like, you're the building. Hulk, so, like, you just causing any kind of mayhem oh, okay. causes that. So you can be walking down the street and you go, oh, I stepped on a car. Oops. <laughs> That's the Hulk. That, and then they just try to stop you and you kill them all. Is that pretty much what yes. happens? What is, like, the five stars in the Hulk? Is it uh, it, it, you, you can only go up to three at the start, and then it increases to Hulkbuster units. <laughs> it's not like the Ghostbusters, but with the Hulk? No, that's like Iron Man tier. Oh. Yeah, it's bad stuff. The well, Hulkbuster crossover. stuff is like is the worst thing to come after the Hulk, usually. No. Oh, okay. Like, uh, you, you actually saw the new animated series. Yeah. You know that big suit? Oh, okay. That they had to yeah, fight? Yeah. That's the Hulkbuster Iron Man suit. That's, uh, that's annoying. All right. Yeah, that those aren't fun. That's bad um, bears. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yay. But um, the nice thing is, though, is one of the collectibles, you actually have to destroy landmarks and collect oh. tokens. <laughs> Are they, like, within the landmarks? Within yeah, literally. They, they crumble, and there's a landmark in it. There's, like, a token in its place. That's awesome. It's kind of silly. But um, they're actually, all of them are marked in your map, which ones you've gotten, too, which is kind of cool. Oh, that's good. But uh, doing that will, of course, get you in trouble. <laughs> so, just, just slightly. Just slightly. So that's one you kind of want to go for before you get your wanted meter increased. <laughs> And that's for uh, Enemy of the Empire State, is that achievement, by the way. And I like the other one, which is Terrifying Tourist, which is to find every subway station. I'm not sure if it's, you know, 100% accurate, but there's a, there's a lot of subway stations in New York. A there's lot. A 10 of them in this game. I think the ones that are there might be accurate. Then again, I don't live there, so yeah, I Yeah, there's, uh, there's about 5 million quadrillion. Yeah, exactly. That may be a little exaggerated. It's probably more like 4 million quadrillion, but there's a lot. Yeah, you, you are off by 1 million quadrillion. Yeah. Give or take. Uh, I like the name of the next achievement, though, which is smash a fist <laughs> <laughs> That's a great that. name, isn't it? When a story mission without defeating any enemies, how do you do that? Isn't like that's the whole thing? Yeah, well, you can probably just run at them. Uh, I guess so. Yeah. Just be like, oh, excuse me, pardon me. Excuse yeah, me. just, just like Hulk's like, get out of my way. I need to get to head of line. <laughs> Give or it take that. Hopefully there's, like, are there missions from, like, get to point A to point B? Because I know. Well, there I probably assume... is. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've I probably got about halfway through this game. I've done all the collecting, though. All right. It's Which took me, like, a, a few days. To do, yeah, as you well, can when there's, like, 6,000 collectibles, you know, happens. Yes. Now, the next one, which is Master of Disaster, which is destroy every building in a New York City neighborhood. A lot of buildings. 
A lot of buildings, but they're uh, they're nicely sectioned in your map. Yeah, I was about to say, hopefully they're sectioned or else you're going to be destroying buildings forever. Yeah, uh, all of the guides, I know this is kind of funny about to say this, is they say, they say destroy Spanish Harlem. Wow. Yeah, it's Both a small my parents section. grew up there. I'm a little, uh, little offended. Who made this <laughs> game? Who made this game? <laughs> People. Uh, I'm going to look at the box art. I'm going to yell. You're gonna at yell. the box art, not at, I'm not gonna approach anybody. I'm just gonna yeah yell. Well, you don't want to yell at the Hulk because you're gonna die. Yeah, absolutely. I'll be like, you are a mean individual. And that's all I got. I'm sorry, Edward Norton. Yeah. Which well, actually does the voice in the game. Oh, that's good. He sounds completely disinterested, but he does the voice. Yeah, well, at least I got him to do the voice. Yeah. <laughs> um, next up, we have Shellhead, which is the the cryptic achievement title with friends like this dot dot dot, dot, dot. is that a secret what? achievement or is no that's actually not a secret achievement okay. that is to pretty much meet a hulkbuster unit oh okay oh i and... see the little okay i get it yeah see uh, yeah, get now it. here's the thing though this and the next achievement are both tied to the one dickish thing in this game oh now this achievement's unlocked two ways meeting a hulkbuster unit or having the hulkbuster um hulk suit which you actually there's a bunch of different costumes for the hulk but that is actually the Iron Man in the Hulkbuster suit. As the you can play as that, jeez, which is kind of cool. Now to unlock that, as I said, either meet a Hulkbuster unit or have a save from Iron Man. The first, the first one. Oh, the, first the second one. one's not. Yeah, yeah, the first one. Now here's where it gets dickish. The next one, which is Hulk is strongest there is. Sweet. I did an arm pump when I did that, which is to gain access to all the upgrades. Those are by doing feats in the game. Mm -hmm. One of the feats, or it's one of the concept arts. One of those two, I can't remember. You have to have the Iron Man save, so it's actually a requirement to get the 1,000, is to have a save from that game. Isn't that, like, can't they not do that? Like, in order well, to get all they, the they, they cannot do a lot of things that they break all the time. I guess that's true. They Remember when games only had a 1,000 gamer score and Oblivion is like, oh, fuck you, 1250? Remember, game, remember when games didn't have a 1,000 gamer score? <laughs> remember Condemned with 970? Yeah. Uh, but this is a pretty fantastic game. Uh, yeah. Achievements don't look too bad. The collectibles make me sat in the pants, and the whole Iron Man thing does not make me well, happy. Well, here's but... the thing, though. It's literally just a save. You can literally like do like a little bit of the game, maybe not get any achievement, and then you have your save. Yeah. I, I'm assuming the game is only like three dollars, so I can be like, hey, I need this for uh, like 45 minutes. I'll be back to return it. Brb. 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 And you, like you have the game like in your car or something. Yeah. Does it work the other way? Like, is there an Iron Man achievement that needs a Hulk no. save? No. That's it. Uh, for my knowledge, the entirety of the five Marvel games. Yeah. These five games. Um, this is the only one like that. Okay. That's not that bad, I guess. No, it's not. And the game is quite a bit of fun. I mean, how much fun is it just... You could just run around New York City as the Hulk. And destroy shit. Lots of shit. Yeah, you just... You could take... You can make your own game of Rampage. Yes. Great game. It is a great game. There's also some multiplayer in this game, too. Is there no really? achievements for it. Oh, thank God. I know that was your next question. <laughs> no... But no, it is, it is quite an, it's, for, I would say for an open world game, it's an easy thousand. Well, there you go. 